Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna do a video about my spring summer outfits because every year I think I get so many questions regarding the trends and outfits that I'm wearing. I just love the combinations between silk shirt, cotton shirt and like just really like this kind of baggy vibes but still keep it classy and I just combine it like with I would say very much my style so you would say it's a little bit this Dolce Vita so with kind of the outfits like scream of this old money aesthetics these are the outfits that I put together I think I really like every and each single of them I think it's time to get dressed or we have to get into the groove so let's start let's go Right, so we start this with one really classy look. The thing that I love about this outfit is just like the combination between pleated pants, uh, really good high quality materials, so it's like not too hot, nothing out of plastics. So on top of that, I just combine it with shirt. This one is from COS. I just love the material. It's just, it feels like very soft. Usually I would always rock the shirt with three buttons open when it's like super summerish, super hot. If it's a little bit more formal, of course, I would close one button so it's a little bit more formal. But if you're a savage, you can do three buttons. And of course, don't forget some details. I have here some necklace and this necklace is from my brand, the Crema. So it's like low key hiding behind, you know, it's not really popping in your face. It's a little bit behind. On top of that, we can spice it up, I think with a nice bag. In summer, I would always rock loafers without the socks. I just like this kind of, um, yeah, transition between pants and loafers. There's like no socks at all. Again, I'm going with the pleated pants. These are as well vintage, a little bit oversized and I don't know, just like this baggy summer vibes. It's still very classy in my opinion. So on top of that, of course, because spring is not really like so warm, I would just like put this vintage leather jacket. When I'm in Italy, I'm usually always like driving with a Vespa. So it's like to keep it something warm in case of wind. Like before we have details that they make the whole outfit even more appealing, I would say. So again, the same belt, again, the jewelry, and the necklace. The black loafers, these one are from Nubik. They are really, really comfortable. I really like here the combination between white and black. I think it looks very sleek and maybe to spice it up, I can even put like a scarf. I just did like a double knot, like very simple. I think I really, really like it. Also the simplicity of vintage good old leather jackets, just like, you know, screaming on that old money aesthetics vibe. I kept the pants the same. Actually, the whole outfit right now is vintage. Also, this shirt is Prada vintage, which I was really lucky to find. And on top of that is blazer. I would say that this outfit really screams like, you know, summer wedding to spice it up. I just went with the scarf because I think it looks like very classy. And I don't know, since lately, I've been digging a lot, like this kind of like scarf vibes. If you have like a formal dinner or if you go on a very fancy date, I think this outfit is a no brainer. Summer and spring, I'm a big fan of loafers, especially these loafers. I think they're very simple, but yet they make the whole look a bit more formal and classy. You know, just blazer off, shirt a little bit open, of course, and do one button. So it looks like a little bit like really leger. Yeah, I think we're ready for the next outfit. So once again, the whole outfit is based on, on high quality materials. So we have linen pants. These are really, really nice fit. I just love the way how they fell on my sneakers. If they finish a little bit like wide and baggy, the way they end up here, I would always go with chunky sneakers because it just looks way more aesthetically pleasing. And then I went with silk shirt and tank top. Yeah, and I think the tank top in a combination with these classy pants, it just look like very much classy old money aesthetics. I went again with the scarf, gold jewelry, and as well with gold watch. In the scarf, there is, there is like a little bit of blue tones with the blue silk shirt. I think it looks very, very sophisticated. Pants are from Eileen Koenig, and I think I just become a big fan of them. So these sneakers are from Copenhagen Studios. Really love the fit, really love how comfy they are. And yeah, that's it. Off to the next one. 
So next look, pretty basic, pretty casual, but I just like love this look, especially like combined with like knitwear polo and I think some black loafers. And these are the Levi 500 ones. I think I could rock this look nearly every day for any kind of occasion, uh, pretty simple fit. Also one important tip, like when you combine this kind of like simple fits, like always pay attention to kind of details. So belt, golden ring in my case, and golden necklace, effortless Dolce Vita. Like you don't have to put it anything. Maybe you can even put like a blazer on top if it's like, let's say too cold or too windy, but yeah, it's for sure like one of the easiest and a really effortless look, I would say. edgy look. I think the leather jacket makes it a little bit more, you know, it's kind of like Berlin vibes. Yeah, just combination with leather jacket and black loafers. Then went with the pants that I already showed you before, Eileen Koenig, and the shirt is a little bit oversized American vintage. Okay, on top of that, cappy, that's how it looks without the jacket. When it comes to the summer basic, I've been like a huge fan of silk shirts and especially like in combination with linen pants, it's just like a no brainer for any kind of summer day. Uh, the blazer is a little bit oversized, especially here in the combination with loafers and silk shirt, it just looks like really fine and really leger. So it just looks so classy in my opinion. The loafers, I also like, I choose the different loafers now. These ones, they don't have a plateau. They're like, just like penny loafers. These ones are from Lloyd. I also really, really like them, especially the quality. I just have a feeling that they are super comfortable. You could walk the whole day in. And that's actually one of the main reasons why I choose loafers in summer, because they just feel so comfortable, but they give like an extra value to your outfit, in my opinion. I actually really, really like the fit of the oversized blazer, especially in the summer, let's say evening, if it's a little bit like fresh and chilly, like if you're on the Malfi coast or somewhere where there's like a little bit wind, blazer saves your ass always. These are just like blue light glasses. When it comes to the silk shirt, I've been a huge fan of silk shirts and I just love how they feel. They're very classy indeed. Especially, I think the most important thing when it comes to the silk shirts, if you want to have these classy vibes that you keep them open a little bit, of course, it depends on your preferences. I always like to tuck it in. As you know it, it's not a surprise. Um, but again, even for example, if you pull it out, I mean, shirt, not anything else, obviously. You know, it doesn't look too bad either. And you know, the good thing about the silk shirt, you just switch the shirt and it looks immediately completely different. Uh, let's try it. It's a dark green, olive green, really, really nice color in my opinion. Silk shirt, try it out. Always go with a little bit oversized uh, fit. I also did like a little bit of research that silk shirts are not so sustainable. That's why I really like to buy it vintage. So, cause then you think about it, it is actually sustainable and there are like a lot of possibilities to buy vintage. Of course, if you're gonna buy like original in the store, like first price, you're gonna pay quite a lot because it is the kind of one of the finest materials out there. So vintage, you're gonna save money and you're gonna be more sustainable. So good option. Really big fan of this outfit, especially, you know, I really like the combination between sneakers, black, black, and then in between some kind of like earthy tones. I really dig that, especially with the details of some jewelry. This could be like a perfect outfit, let's say late spring that you go on a walk and you're not sure if it's gonna be like a little bit fresh, a little bit breezy. So uh, on top of that, like high quality knitwear. So I would either wear it like this, because it looks a little bit different than how everybody's wearing it, or you have it like classic, like scarf option. The black t-shirt is a very simple, basic t-shirt, oversized. So as you know me, some accessories. So for example, like analog camera is a good option, uh, of course, for taking photos. Uh, I'm a big fan of analog photography and you're good to go. And you know, let's say that if it will be like way too cold, you will still have a feeling like, you know, I don't know, it's like 10 degrees and you would be like, hmm, maybe I'm gonna be cold. You can just put like denim jacket on, like a little bit oversized denim jacket. Wait, let's just try it. Yeah, so there you go. Uh, All right guys, so this look is really, I would say that one of my favorite at the moment, this combination like all white with some uh, popping details of the silk scarf. And let's just combine it with a blazer so you will see how immediately uh, changes the vibe in a second. There you go. Just two slight details I changed, the double breasted blazer on 
and different loafers and it immediately looks like so classy especially the combination with white denim and dark blue blazer and cream vest looks like timeless and very much classy the pants are a little bit different than before these are also like double pleated vintage pants they are a little bit more creamy or maybe you can say a little bit more yellowish and on top of that i have a really nice shirt let's say you go to the beach club or whatever or maybe a nice rings of course you could have it closed and then afterwards when you realize okay it's a little bit too hot or if it's not or I'm feeling I'm feeling myself I can just open up a little bit and on top of that uh, I have also a really nice sandals from Inuiki exactly this kind of vibe I don't know I'll go to Barcelona uh, or the kind of Mediterranean city uh, next to the sea I also kind of really like it also especially kind of the pop of the color the green um, it just doesn't look so boring anymore. Just like different tension, I would say. Some jewelry is always like crucial, I think, when it comes to the outfits like this. It's just like, you know, adds a character. So as well, I'm just wearing the same thing as before. Ring, necklace. For the evening, I think it's a nice to go on a gelato. And I think my mom just arrived for the coffee.